Hello everyone, my name is Larseth, and welcome back to episode 34 of our Bengal campaign in Europa Universalis 4. And this episode, I'm not sure what we're going to do. Um, I was having a quick look before we before I start recording, and I noticed we've got 11 more uh, sort of entries in our army force limit that we can take advantage of, so we should probably do that at some point. We've also got a fair amount in our naval entries that we can we can take care of as well. So we'll have to do something with uh, with all that, um, which will get done at some point. And a few things people commented on, um, so that I'll uh, I'll try I'll try and keep keep up on. So first of all is regarding maybe Ally in Castile or Portugal. Um, I had a look; they're both hostile to me because they both both want the same province, which is Mong Con. Uh, I can't pronounce that, so I'm not going to bother. But I'm fairly certain. It's this province. They want that province, so I have no idea why. They can't have a mission for it. I actually I looked and both of them Where's this show? It said says down here. They have a missions for Macas they have Macassar. Which is here. So they have missions for Well actually taking this province, taking Macassar. Which is a little weird. What the hell? The Ottomans are over here. The Ottomans went for exploration. My god. <laughs> okay, interesting. That's a bit weird. Um, might be that I could get an, uh, an alliance with them at some point. So that's sort of alliances with uh, Castile and Portugal that I can't go for, unfortunately. I might try and improve relations with them. Other things would be... Um, Doing some conquests in this area. I looked at Shan, and they are actually being currently guaranteed by Changsheng, who are one of my allies. So that's a bit of a pain. Yi is a possibility. Um, purely because they basically um, the their only allies are this one, this province here, and Shan. Uh, no, and Hesenwe, sorry, and they need to go to war with Hesenwe anyway. So, I could actually do this. So, what I'm going to do is pull our guy back from Barmanis. And send him over here. To start uh, getting a claim on... Well, I only need one to get a claim on this province here before I can get into a war. I'm going to keep my uh, guy going in Oirat. Improving relations with Persia. How far are we through that? We've only, uh, We must have only just started at the end of last episode. Um, so we might as well press press play. Another thing I want to do, other than build up our army and navy. Oh dear, one of our army. Uh, generals, that's the word. Died. That's not good. Um, so we're currently having some people who are about to rebel. So what I'm going to do is raise my army maintenance all the way up. I mean, we're still making 22 ducats even with that. I mean, and we'll be making even more once we get rid of this corruption. Oh dear. Uh, Liang want military access. That's fine. I'm going to deny it to Hasenwe. That's good. So, uh, Liang probably wanting to come through me to, to get to this province here, I'm guessing. Hopefully these uh, revolts will be dealt with. They just won't revolt, maybe. I'm not terribly worried about them at all. Right, so we can invest in technology. How far are we from getting this, the next institution? Because that's the thing I just realized I'm not paying enough attention to. 1,600 and... It's only going up by the looks of it. Okay. Uh, I don't mind Delhi getting um, spy power my nation. I not going to do anything with it, so. Right. There we go. Solved that. So we'll come down here. Unfortunately, they are going to, they're going to call separatism in there, but it won't be too bad. Especially with the minus 100 we'll get from actually defeating the rebels. Uh, execute bailiff. I don't want to lose prestige if I can help it. That's all good and well. What, <coughs> excuse me. What missions do we have? Build a textile manufacturing. Oh, okay, so we are actually still doing that mission. Uh, I might as well start converting some of these provinces. 
while I'm here. No reason not to. I think actually I might, rather than spend money at the moment, save up my money and try get the next... Uh, where is it? I'm looking on the wrong page continuously. <coughs> the next, um... My god. Um, get the next... Tech. Uh, not next tech, sorry. The next, uh... Thingy. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna go and wait and try and get this. So, that's fine. So we're gonna not spend anything, or try not to spend anything for a while. France have just gained a claim in Natal. That is not good. <laughs> that is not good at all. Oh dear. Okay, they want all of my stuff. That is... Should I be worried? Probably. <laughs> right, so these guys, I can now fabricate a claim. So we will do that, and then we can uh, bring our guy back. We don't need him there anymore. One of our advisors has died, which isn't ideal. Uh, morale of armies is good. I'm going to actually improve relations with France. And, like, try and do absolutely everything I can to avoid them, you know, wanting to eat me alive. That would be nice. I'll also improve relations with Castile. Seems like there's not really that much else I need to do at the moment. Fortunately, I've got a fair few allies in this region, so that should stop Balmanis from wanting to attack me, at least immediately. Um, what else am I going to do? Technically, I could vassalize these guys. They probably would. But who knows? Is it worth it? Um, annoyingly, it would increase our piety, but there we go. Yeah, I'd say we... Hmm. This is a tough choice, whether I try and... I don't think they, will, they would end up wanting us to vassalize them, so I think I'm just going to go to war. Um, so nobody will join them, and... Well, I don't need anyone to join me, so... I'll just march this army over here. And then we'll go to war that way. Because Hassan we won't join, which is a little bit annoying because we would like to go to war with them. But we could do that eventually. So that's we'll get confirmed, go to war with them. Mal will give his gift. How nice of them. So France. We barely made it into plus figures for relations with them. It's gone up to minus four. Well, actually, it's gone back down again. They want a lot of our provinces, and I unfortunately, I think they're going to probably take them. I can't imagine it'll be too long before they do declare war. And I, there's no point putting up a fight, because I won't be able to beat them. So, yeah. Um... Don't mind. Just noticed all their one stacks are running off up there. I don't mind. They can go sit up there if they want. It's not the end of the world. Ooh, 10 diplomatic power. Don't mind if I do. Baluchistan's opinion increased. It's always nice. Uh, lose piety. That's fine. I'm happy to lose piety. That made up for the piety we gained from starting this war. So I can deal with that. I've lost some claims. I believe all those claims were from Oirat. So I should probably get those claims back. And continue building spy network. I mean, it, I can quite easily go in small wars like this, because... Like, it, this doesn't cost me any manpower, essentially. And they don't take that long to do, so it's, if Batman is, were to attack me, you know, it's not the end of the world. Um... Right, one of my provinces is done. So let's make this estate. 
And I guess now we need to send this guy probably. Where's the next highest development province here? This province is an eight development province. So we will send our guys over there. A truce with Gujarat and Bamamas is now over. So this is where the fun begins, I guess. Seeing if they'll actually attack me or not. Be interesting. Uh, right. This war is over against um, what their name is. Yi. So I'm going to wait until I get Ooh, I want stability. Please. I'm going to wait until I get 30 Diplo or rather spy network points. I'll get a claim in Oirat and bring my guy back from there. For the moment. There we go. Sorted. Harpka claim. I don't really mind where. I'm going to get claims everywhere at some point. And we'll end this war. So we're going to take the province that we wanted. Hypothetically, if I were to do that, would it annoy everyone? No, it wouldn't. So I may actually do that. Yeah, it wouldn't annoy people too much. So I'm going to do that. Take everything. Um, Do I need these guys up here? Where's the unrest kicking about? There's a bit of unrest up this end. What province is that? Gari. That would take a long time to convert. I'll just convert these easy ones. Um, these, this army down here should be fine. Yeah, they don't take, these ones don't take that, cost that much to core anyway, so it's not the end of the world that we, uh, took really, you know, we didn't have claims on them. Um, how's everything going with Portugal and whatnot? Portugal would actually accept an alliance, amazingly. Bra uh... Castile wouldn't, but that's only because they still have a hostile attitude, which they might well drop. Um, France are not allied with Portugal. That would have been annoying. I um, I really want to just get an alliance with Portugal. Somebody also did mention becoming a protectorate. So what I'm going to do is I'll... Um, I'm actually going to... Do I want to try and maintain relations with Castile? Is it going to do anything? I don't think it will. We could probably make better use of that diplomat. What are you doing? Go back. Go. Right, so request protectorate. Because doesn't that stops us from having vassals and stuff, doesn't it? Becoming a protectorate, as I recall. Which we don't want. I wonder if it says here. France must have some protectorates, surely. Maybe not. Portugal. Do they have any protectorates? Or oh, Connolly's not protectorates. I need to do a bit of looking up on protectorates to see whether or not that will actually be a bad idea. And we might become one, but I'm fairly certain it would be sort of a bad thing. Um, but yeah, we'll get these cored. And where to next? It'd be nice to go to war with Shan, but like I said, they are guaranteed Going into an alliance with Portugal took us over our what's it, but we sort of need that alliance. It's, that may stop France from wanting to eat us alive. May. Not likely, I feel. They probably still will want to eat us alive. But there we go. How much further we got until we can get the next institution? Printing. No, not that one. Um, Not far, actually. Um, do I want prestige or base tax? Probably base tax there, to be honest. Hmm. The following provinces haven't embraced global trade and incur extra costs. So this goes down the more places embrace, embrace it. So... Okay. 
So I guess I'd get around that by improving provinces, wouldn't I? Something like that. Uh, recall Lago from Changcheng, and we will also uh, deactivate all of our forts for the moment, just because we want that money to be going towards our institution acceptance fund. Because currently we're paying, what, twice as much for tech as we should be? I'm going to maintain relations with Portugal because I do not want that going down. I fully uh, have cla uh, made claims. I don't particularly care. So I've got a decent amount of allies in that region, so that should be of no consequence to myself. What's this then? Oh god, lots of stuff. Colonial company goes bankrupt. Time for us to step in, I guess. Right, our manufacturing finished, so... Our recruitment was sabotaged, which is annoying. Although, that does suggest to me that somebody might be willing or about to declare war on me. So, I'm... Uh, do I rate... Do I do my forts? I might just do these forts, because I do not trust Barmanis. Of course, I could throw them, to be honest. So, I'm just going to do my forts around my capital and stuff like that. Um... Can I upgrade any forts in this region? I can. Oh god, that's a lot of stuff. Uh, I don't mind paying for that. I'm gonna just delay getting these stuff a little bit. Call our guy from Shu. Who else do we need to improve relations with our allies? Malwa could probably do with it. Malwa. Improve relations. And also, we should see if we can get anything from our estates or New World Charter related thingies. Grant that, which means we can get that. And establish New World missions. Fabulous. So that's a nice bonus to our colonies. Actually, speaking of which, we should have one that's finished soon. Build trade company in Damin. Okay. Where's Damin? Why the hell would I build a trade company? Oh, it means, sorry, I was thinking of a trade, like, you know, the trade nation thingies, as opposed to, like, the manufactory trade companies. So I assume this helps. Oops, that was the wrong one. I was going for this screen. Building support for manufactories is what that last mission was for, and actually this is similar. But I really want the settler chance stuff, so... Colonize Bhutan. Um, okay, this is literally right next door to where we currently are, so I'm going to go for that. We had a reclaim mission, but the chance of me actually reclaiming that at the moment is pretty low. I think. What I'm going to do is I'm going to swap over to... Um, uh, military tech, because I'm going to take a defensive, probably. I think that's probably the best thing to do. Lose five prestige over five legitimacy any day. And there we go. And we just finished one of our colonies. So we'll immediately send him over hither. And our army over there as well. Fabulous. See, it's not all bad. We'll get our land back from Balmanis in the end. They're still allied with France, Gujarat. What is their uh, relations with France? Mm, they, they, they could be better. But interestingly, France actually desire one of their things. See, my theory. Sorry, this timer going off. My theory is that eventually they're going to have a few issues because oh, like Portugal have now got Goa. I didn't. I don't know how long they've had it, but. Barmanis are much more likely to have a mission for uh, colonizers to go after them. You know, there's much more likely that Portugal, Castile, Great Britain, or uh, England, if it's still England. No, it is Great Britain. Um, and France are going to get missions for somewhere in Barmanis than they are for my provinces. With the exception of maybe some of these over here. But we'll deal with those later. Um, I'll end the episode here. Next episode, we'll obviously finish coring this stuff, and hopefully we'll get... We'll, wow. We've got a load of uh, points saved up at the moment, so we're, we will buy 
the next institution, then take our admin tech so we can get another idea group, and then we'll take our... Um, we won't take the military tech, I don't think. We'll just rush through the ideas instead. Because they're current... Uh, although we are one military tech behind, it's a little bit of an issue. I may even have to buy like a two or three advisor just so I can catch up on that, but we'll deal with that. Anywho, thank you very much for watching, and I will speak to you in the next episode. Take care.